Hello there peeps, welcome back to Subnautica and today we are going to check out, well we're not really going to the Aurora like I said in the last episode with the Cyclops, but what we are going to do is we're going to check out the Thermal Plant. Now there is one problem, we do not have a titanium ingot, well just basically the uh, titanium. So we need to quickly go out and salvage more titanium. So let's go ahead and check out this guy, it's still active. Hmm. Yeah, it's pretty much still active. And uh, I just refilled this one with some bio... bio stuff. And this <laughs> rotten watermelon is not going anywhere. It's like still there. But uh, yeah, everything is well and awesome. And uh, I think we should go ahead and use the scanner. Uh, 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 lag, lag. I just Welcome started up the game. Captain. Thank you, lady. I just started up the game and yeah. So let's look at... Well, there is no fragments in the vicinity, seems like it. Hmm. Curious, curious. Speed, range. I would upgrade the range as far as possible. Hmm. Okay, so this means we should just uh, use the... Uh, the seam off. For now. And just go out for adventure. What do you guys say? I think that's a swell idea. So let's climb into the seam off. And Welcome aboard, Captain. Ah, thank you so much, lady. Ah, look at that beauty. Man, she is big. She's really big. Okay. Now, these guys, these talkers, would... Uh, lag. Would have a ton of salvage around them. Yeah. I just want to grab these... Uh, these creep vines, seed clusters. Can I not fit any more into my inventory? Oh, I can. There we go. There we go. And let's use uh, this compartment. Store just a couple of them. Jump back into it. And off we go. Yeah, it's just a couple of salvage parts, not too many. Okay, that's a uh, sand. Oh, over here. Here we go. And grab this piece. Uh, there's a stalker right there. Let's get out before it eats our face off or saws it off or whatever it does. I mean, they are quite powerful. Oh, sorry, fish. Because. Oh, that was a weird graphical glitch. Because they. Um, the salvage parts, they like poke with their nose or stab with their nose and then they pick it up. Ah, uh, here's another part. You know, so they actually do pa pack a punch. Ba -ba -ba. Oh, the lags. Yeah, I should not have <laughs> recorded this episode after playing like 20 other t types of games. There we go. Can we fit? Yeah, we can fit one one more. So let's see if we cannot find one more. I mean, we we probably have enough, I think. But it'd be good to have maybe a redundant or if we do run out or something. Yeah. Hmm. I don't see much anywhere. Ooh. There is one. Will it allow us to grab it? Oh, lag. All the lag. I do apologize. There we go. Grab. In the sea mark. Oh. Don't touch me. You shall not touch me. Alright, this way. Okay, okay. We're off to a good start, I must say. So anyways, um... Yeah, it's all going well, and soon we are going to make a living quarters as well. We are going to the Aurora at some point. It depends on what... Uh, if we can deck out this guy. Maybe this episode we can probably like add a couple of lockers or something into it. I know you can do that. I don't know if it has its own internal storage. And I did see you do have upgrades for it. You can get upgrades. I just do not know, do you upgrade within, or do you upgrade with a console, or what? I don't know. There's probably a console inside the Cyclops. That's what I meant. Okay, let's go. And then, yeah. 
we soon are going to get ourselves a living quarters or you know something with a like an observatory or something with a bench and a chair and I don't know something something and I know there's like a bed or something you can get Ooh, water Let's go ahead and let's drink one. And uh, yes, we do have a little bit of space, but like I said, we need to get that out of the way. You know, the uh, large amount of salt we have. Okay, there we go. And let's go ahead and make some titanium. And more. And more. And that's it. That's it. Okay, now let's check out this guy quickly. So it's one titanium ingot, two magnetites, and one lubricant. Oh, we can craft all of this right now. Uh, lubricant. Oh, it's in the seam off. I forgot we stored it there. Oh, I thought we. Okay, never mind. Let's go and. Da -da -da -da. Let's start filling this one up like so and then one magnetite or two how many was it two i think one two there we go and let's quickly go grab out of the seam of the other things we left behind yeah yeah we still have two upgrade slots left we are definitely going to upgrade to torpedo yes we can fit all of them in nice Let's go back and make some lubricant. And then the geomethermal will be complete. That's not this way. Ugh. Behind me. Ugh. Lag. It's always when I get to this thing. I think this is taking a, up a lot of processing power or something. Okay. Let's see. There we go. So, if I'm not mistaken, the thermal plant must be on a uh, geyser. A steam geyser. Or something. I will show you guys in a bit what I mean. So, should we use the seam off? Yeah, I think we should. What are you doing here? Come here. Come here. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> that was weird. Uh, can I get in? Ah, there we go. Alright, now let's just climb out. And... Oh crap, I ate it. I ate a fish. I ate a live fish. Why did I do that? Why? Okay, so let's look for that heat signature. Uh, where are you? Over there. So over here is the steam geyser, I think. Ooh. Weird graphical glitch. No. Is it this way? I thought it was one close to base. Ugh, the lag is real. It must be rendering in and out the base, I think. Because I know there is a thermal plant or thermal or a uh, steam geyser. Yeah, steam geyser close. Close to the base. And sometimes there are sounds in this game I just do not understand. Where shall you be? Is it this? I think it might be. If I stop lagging. Come on. Stop it already. Yeah, that's it. Alright, so let's leave the seam off over here. Let's climb out. Oh, yeah, I should have planned this better. Okay. Hmm. I think we should go down in deeper. Okay, is it coming? Yeah, it's popping. Baby. Okay. Oops. No. Ooh. Oh. 
Okay, okay, you can... I thought you planted on top of it. Okay, let's go up. Alright. Well, let's just read quickly. It says, converts heat into energy. What does that say? Gold and titanium. Alright. Because I was thinking of using this power transmitter. Alright. Let's go down. A tad bit. Grab this quartz because we can. Oh, there's more quartz. There we go. There's another one over here. Let's go down to over here. So I take it that that is loud. Okay, now, is it... We need to go up for air. Okay, let's go. Okay, so, if I understand that's what it does, though, that's what it's supposed to do. Okay, come on, seam off. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. So, hmm... It is getting power, I take it. It should be getting power, and what I like about it is that... It is a renewable source, so it's not like... It's like a solar panel. You know, it's not like the bioreactor or the uh, nuclear power plant, which you have to refuel, quote-unquote, refuel. Aboard, so let's go make that power transmitters. Maybe getting a couple of them. So it's just one gold and titanium. So let's go ahead and grab... Let's put the quartz away. Nope. Give me back my ma my knife, my knife, mate. And let's go ahead and put these guys back in here. Come on, there we go. Ugh. And epic lag, Ugh, epic lag. Oh man, don't you guys love lag? I love lag. Who doesn't? Let's make about three. You know, three sounds like a a correct number, and it requires one titanium each, I think. Let's check it out. Yeah. Yee yee yee. Let's get some power up on this place, yo. Okay, so the power up here it is not changing. So uh, why do I need that? <laughs> okay, uh, let's go back to the seamoth. Let's grab something to eat very quickly. Otherwise, we will be starving and be thirsty all at the same time. Okay. There we go. Yee. Now let us move along to the power source. I think that's how this works. You know, you guys can let me know in the comment section because I am a bit stupid with these things. You guys are probably shouting at me. It was off to this way, I think. Yeah, over here. And let's just get in closer. Can I just, like, maybe not lag? Oh. Actually. So, I don't know if this will work. I am not too sure. Okay. Let's see what this needs. Or what that means. So let us go ahead. Is it connecting?
Okay, so. that shining towards too. Oh, come on. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Seriously, where is that thing connected to? It's, that's just weird. Yeah, yeah, here it is. I was... I was sort of correct. Okay, okay. I get you. Whoops. I was my bad. I should really see where I was flying, driving. I don't know. You drive a boat? You sail a boat? But it's not really sailing. Alright, so look at that power. That's 900. So a couple of them would mean that... Yeah, okay. So if you have a couple of them around... Hmm... That's interesting. They're a bit expensive to build then, if you need more than one. Yeah. It's gonna be quite expensive. Okay, so let's go ahead and put some of these things back, uh, like the titanium. Chuck it over here. Let's go down into the storage. Put the gold back. Okay. Uh, one silver. I want to do that upgrade for the scanner as well. And... Ta -ta -ta -ta. No, it's two of these, silver and a quartz, I think, for a computer chip. Uh, uh, yeah, it's over here. Ta -ta, electronics, computer chip. Okay. So let's go back over here. And let's see. Oh, okay. That's showing more things now. Range. Then we need quartz as well. Okay, just wanted to double check that. Okay, and it needs one quartz. Alright. Just want to make double sure. Okay. Now let's go ahead and build up the range. And then we upgrade the range. So let's say metal salvage. Let's connect to our camera. Okay, this is the base. It should show up at some point. Okay, it is scanning. Okay, so over here is not a metal salvage. What? That's odd. That's <laughs> really weird and odd. Okay. Okay, there was one thing I wanted to check out more. Okay, let's do this scanner. The gold and computer chip. Let's do that. Okay. Gold and computer chip. And let's see. Let's see. One, two. One, two. Two. Uh, let's do that. Okay. No. And silver. That and one of those. Let's go ahead and make. Didn't I grab silver just now? What did I grab? Oh, copper. Duh. One, two. Go ahead and make a computer chip. I want to make two, just for in case. Okay. We have 
All right, all right. We're good, we're good. Like so. And... Okay, yeah, let's go back. Okay, so the charging fins do work with this thing. Lol. Okay. So, this one. And this one. Range, and... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think this goes on to here. Okay, so now I can see it myself. Okay. Okay. So... Now it's showing me it's down here. Okay. Let's see if we cannot f find... This metal salvage they are talking about. Ugh, where is it? Right underneath me. The serious? Okay. <laughs> Why the hell not? I guess. But uh, yeah, I think this episode's gone along too, gone long in on enough. <laughs> it's been way too long. So yeah. I'm going to end off the episode here, and next episode we will definitely make a trip to the Aurora and see what's going on there. I'll deck out the... We're going to deck out the uh, Cyclops with a couple of locker rooms and stuff, just in case we need it. And, uh, yeah, thank you so much, guys, for joining me here on Subnautica. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.